Hi guys! In today's video, I want to talk about the most important traits that a woman needs in a man. And please don't forget to subscribe if you're not subscribed yet. Stay tuned! Hi! Hi guys! I want to talk about the most important trait in a man. It is emotional strength. Since the beginning of time, we always hear how a woman wants a strong man, right? But it's really not just the physical strength that we need. What we really need is a man who's strong emotionally. So what do I mean by emotionally strong? I mean a man who can be honest with himself. I don't want him to just be honest with me. I want him to be honest with himself first so if a guy isn't honest with himself he's not going to be honest with her and if he can be honest with her there'll be no trust she will feel it deep down we know we can feel it when somebody's lying to us even men they can feel it when the woman is lying humans are not stupid we're very smart <laughs> The reason why I say emotional strength is very important is because if he is emotionally strong, it means that he is available emotionally. He has the capacity to be there for her. He is able to protect her. We want to know that we are safe with you, not just physically, but also emotionally. And that's the most important thing because how we feel reflects the outside. So how you protect her emotions is by being positive with her, by being encouraging, no words of affirmation, not bringing her down. We all have insecurities and sometimes we feel like we're not good enough and if a man can make her feel that she is good enough, that she is beautiful, all these positive things, then he is protecting her emotions. He cares about her feelings. When you notice that she's not being positive with herself, you can remind her of her worth. Not bring her down and be like, oh yeah, you're not really, it was your fault or, you know. I remember one time I went on a date with this guy and uh, accidentally my, my spoon fell on the ground okay <laughs> i felt embarrassed i was like oh my god sorry oh my god and uh, i feel i feel embarrassed and then what did he say he said yeah you should can you believe that's what he said <laughs> and of course i never went i went out with this guy again <laughs> but that's just one of the things that he did oh my god i should make a video about this huh? it was full of red flags that date i have to make a video about it Make sure you subscribe if you want to see that video. <laughs> that was the response of a man who is immature. A man who is not emotionally strong man. Uh, an, an emotionally strong man, what he would say, he'd be like, no, don't worry, you know? Things happen. Don't blame yourself. I mean, the spoon fell by itself. I didn't, like, I didn't hold my spoon and be like, Pfft. I didn't throw. <laughs> I didn't throw the spoon. It just happened. So an emotional strong man would be like, no, it's not your fault, you know, things happen, it's fine, I'm just, I'm glad you're okay. Or maybe he would throw his f spoon too, he'd be like, oh look, me too, you know? <laughs> like he, he could be like, you know, be funny with it and be like, you see, me too. <laughs> the thing is, it was just very loud when it, when it fell, the spoon was just, I was like, you know, like falling apart. <laughs> Even though he was... The most handsome guy in in university and all the girls were just like crazy for him um i still refused to go on a second date with him because because of how he made me feel did he make me feel safe emotionally that he's gonna care about my feelings no so it doesn't matter how handsome you are what really really matters to a woman is if he can make her feel safe emotionally another thing is supporting her dreams even if they're crazy you have to make her feel that she can do it and she can do anything empower her not bring her down um i have another story for that 
an ex from a long time ago uh, when I started doing music he wasn't happy with that and he started to get really jealous and he kept telling me that I shouldn't do it he told me not to sing you're a Saudi woman like you're not supposed to sing you're crazy you're not normal and um, that's just one of them <laughs> that's, the, that's the second one actually that I dated the first one I dated he also didn't like that I sing but he lied to me he lied to me and he said, yeah, you're great, awesome. But behind my back, he was trying to ruin my plans. As someone who's not emotionally strong, what he would do, either hide his true feelings uh, or lie, you know? That's both emotionally immature men. And that's not what you need. You need somebody who will support your dreams and he will encourage encourage you even if your dreams are crazy <laughs> because if not your partner then who you know this is your partner for for life this guy is this gonna be the person that you're gonna spend your whole life with he has to be emotionally supportive to you um the first one does not regret what he did he actually a few years later we talked and he confessed to me that he never liked the fact that I sing and he doesn't support it. And I was like, whatever, <laughs> bye. Uh, the second one, uh, he, um, he actually regret everything and he apologized to me. And he told me that he was going through a depression and he, he was jealous that I had, this, had all these dreams and I, I wanted to achieve. And, and he felt like he was in a place where he couldn't he just didn't have that drive or motivation to follow his dreams and so he wanted to stop me he wanted to bring me down with him <laughs> um he apologized to me and uh, of course i forgave him i forgive them all i forgive them all all of them <laughs> but it doesn't mean i have to date them <laughs> that's why i said in my last video a confused man video i said that if he's broken don't date him because if he is going through a depression he can't really be emotionally supportive to you he needs to be emotionally available for himself first so he can be emotionally available to you so that's something that you need to pay attention to does this guy have any issues <laughs> with emotions so if a guy can be all these things if he can be honest with himself if he can support your dreams uh, care for your feelings, protect your feelings, be an encouraging man. This man is a good man. This way a woman can feel safe and she can trust him and she can open up to him. They can build a relationship based on trust. It's something with a good foundation because people who lie and dishonesty and and games and manipulation you can't build anything good on that like it's just like a building just imagine if the building was built on a very bad um, base it's gonna fall it's gonna fall eventually unless you fix the base and you start right over from the beginning and you start with honesty transparency and clear communication then you can build something great together yep and this is what i wanted to talk about today because i think a lot of men go to the gym and work out and make sure they're, they're strong and, but they forget about emotional strength it is really important to work on your f physical strength of course to be healthy that's one of one of the ways you show love to yourself it's a very good thing but you have to also work on yourself on your emotions and uh, I just want encouragement to care about their emotions and not just their physical invest in yourself invest in your emotions <laughs> that's it so if you enjoyed the video please don't forget to like and subscribe and uh, the bell button and I have a patreon account if you like to support me the link is in the description Thank you so much, guys. And I will see you in the next video. Bye.
Still come.